Hi everyone, this is Becky Berg and welcome to Introduction to Number Sense Routines. Let's just begin our time with a short routine called Would You Rather. So put your learner hat on. So would you rather have option A or option B? Hmm, some of you perhaps are thinking you'd rather have option B. You might say, well, I would like to have three packages of those pumpkin peeps because I prefer that flavor. I'd get 24 of them. Some of you might say, well, I would prefer option A because both of them you would get 24 peeps, but the ghost peeps are larger than the pumpkin peeps. So I'd like 24 of the ghost peeps. All right, now, teacher hats, you can see this is a pretty short routine. The idea would be, hey, choose what you prefer and be ready to justify your thinking. Within a few short minutes, we would talk about multiplication and products. And one of my main goals here would be about that commutative property of multiplication, okay? So just a short example of one number sense routine just to give you a little snapshot. Now, our targets for this module is I want you to be just able to justify why these routines are so valuable and to describe the components of a high quality number sense routine. All right, so let's just start with what are they? What exactly are number sense routines? Well, number sense routines are an engaging, accessible, and purposeful routine that you're going to begin your math class with. And it really promotes a community of positive math discussion and thinking. Okay, sets the stage for a nice, um, comfortable place to be during our math time. When do we do these routines? Well, at the start of math class, and really they're short. Many times this number sense routine takes five minutes or a bit more, okay? We have a lot to do during our math time. So it seems as though lately, when I've been speaking with teachers and engaging with them, the magical time for me is around seven minutes, okay? And really we get a lot done within this short amount of time, okay? As you can see here, um, in the math workshop model, for example, no matter what your day looks like, whether you're doing a rich task or you're doing a focus lesson with some teacher time and some independent workstations, each structure within Math Workshop Model, for example, begins with a number sense routine. So I just think it's, it's really, regardless of what structure you use, it's kind of like doing a read aloud at the beginning of your reading block or some shared reading time together. It just kind of brings us together and sets a positive stage for our math block. Okay, so why number sense routines? What are the benefits? Number sense routines help build students number sense and procedural fluency and oftentimes we're saying boy our kids just don't have number sense so this can be one piece of the pie that can help. And like I said, it promotes that respectful learning community. Makes us feel safe, confident, and comfortable. Number sense routines encourage the use of mental math and thinking. It gets students explaining their thinking, justifying their reasoning. And it really does support a variety of strategies, right? It's not just about plugging and chugging and getting that one right answer. Now, what I've come to find is that when I plan these number sense routines with intention and purpose, oftentimes in five to seven minutes, I'm able to front load where I'm headed, right? So really connecting to some of those gaps or holes that our students have so that they're ready to enter into that grade level content really helps us connect to that background knowledge and these number sense routines prove over and over again to be just great, authentic, formative assessments for me to see what kiddos know and perhaps what they don't quite yet know. 
All right, and I think that's more important than ever. Now, what are the other benefits? Well, you know, we're familiar with Marzano's um, meta-analysis, and one of his number one strategies is that of identifying similarities and differences. So as we continue on, we're going to keep coming back to this idea of how do these number sense routines allow students to find similarities and differences, okay? Um, we know this is a high yield strategy, therefore let's engage kids in routines that allow them opportunities for those strategies, okay? Another benefit and reason for using number sense routines is they directly tie to these standards for mathematical practice. All right, so as we step into different routines throughout, we are going to start to make these connections to the mathematical practice standards that are common throughout K-12. All right, and one of those practice standards really emphasizes the importance of kids critiquing the reasoning of others and justifying their thinking. So um, the talk moves uh, are really woven into these mathematical number sense routines. So that's another great reason is the routines lend themselves for discourse amongst our students. All right. And I just feel like it's high returns on smart investments. We have an issue with not having enough time in our classrooms. Not enough time. We are more having more content than we do time. I am finding that these short routines give us high returns on those smart investments. All right. So I just feel like that's one reason we really need to keep capitalizing on these number sense routines. So hopefully you can now justify why they're valuable and you can describe the components of a high quality number sense routine.